Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to surprise play with my glue book because it's a lot of fun. Like, I don't know. I didn't expect to have this much fun with it, to be honest with you, but I just really enjoy just putting things in a book and making it pretty. Like, I don't know. I just like, it's fun to look at. It's fun to touch. Like, it's just, it's just fun. Like, I don't know. So we're going to keep playing because, well, why not, right? So I've got some extra stuff in here. This is my food. Like, the, uh, this is the first magazine that my husband brought home. And it's like a bunch of food and stuff like that. Um, so I guess we could play in there. See what we got. Um, we've got some. Ooh, those are pretty. And we've got some the best Christmas ever. Uh, yeah. Cultivate kindness. I love that. We're so using that. And some candies and gingerbreads and such. Other oh, cookies, not candies. Cookies. And just a pretty color. Some green. Uh, it's cookie season. Yes, it is. I love making cookies. I like eating cookies, too. I mean, we're going to be really honest here. Let's make it together. So who's playing around with the with the glue book with me? Thoughts? Thoughts? Let's, you know what? I'm going to stop doing this because I have a really bad habit of just like, overthinking, overanalyzing, and we're just going to glue stuff down. Because that's the whole point, right? Um, as soon as I find my glue. <laughs> so I have a couple different glues out. And I also have a glue bottle that's on my desk, even though it's not really, um, well, it's not going to remain mine. I'm making it for a custom order. And, um, it's, it throws me off because my glue bottles are decorated and I keep trying to grab it, but there's nothing in it. It's just an empty bottle. I can show you guys. It's really pretty. I absolutely love this guy. Is it bad that like every time I make one of these, I just want to keep it. <laughs> This one keep it forever and this one is going to be a set so it's going to have the little topper thing on it too but it's like right beside me so i keep trying to grab it <laughs> it's mine i don't think my my person who i'm making that for would appreciate that since she probably wants to keep it herself but i can try right So, so far I've made like four sets. Um, and if you want a custom order set, let me know because I am going to, um, once I finish this batch of custom orders, I'm not going to take custom orders anymore and I'm just going to make them and put them on the shop. Uh, that way I can kind of move on to something different, you know? Like I really, really enjoy doing them, but... It can't be the only thing I do. You know what I mean? So I really want to use this whatever this is. I have no idea what this is, but it looks really, really fun. So I really want to use it. Can I like just fold it right here? I mean, I guess I can do whatever I want, huh? It is my Google book. I'm learning, okay? I'm learning. I am trying to abide by rules that Everybody is like, no oh, rules. And I'm like, I like you people. I like no rules. All right. I was sitting on my foot. I had to get off of my foot. I think I folded that in the wrong spot. No, I think I'm just going to cut it off. Because it's just going to irk me now. Oh, I have an idea. Why don't we just do it this way? Ha ha! Poof. 
problem solved. Oh, and now we can put it here on the bottom. All right. And if you guys have a glue book, what kind of glue do you use? Do you use like one glue throughout the whole thing? Do you kind of flip flop back and forth? Like, what do you guys use in your glue books? Um, I've used a couple different ones so far. This is my first glue book, so I am learning like the ropes, as you will. I don't really know what is the best glue to use to kind of ensure. Okay, that's really cool. That it stays, you know. Like right now I'm using a uh, glue stick, but it is a really great glue stick. Um, it's the Uhu. The Uhu stick. We can do it's cookie season followed by a giant cookie tree. Can we do that? Let's do the giant cookie tree. And then I'm going to pull and grab some things that aren't magazines because I think I've got some yum yum good good stuff that's not magazine related. I don't know what to do with you right now. All right. Wait. All that. Alright, so I don't want this stuff all over my desk. I have I have stuff everywhere. Like I really, really do. And if you guys could see my desk, like all the way my desk, oh my gosh. Some of you guys that are constantly like, oh my gosh, you're so organized. You would probably freak out. Because there are certain aspects that I have very well organized, but there are certain aspects that are definitely not very well organized. And I love popcorn, so we're putting the popcorn on here. And I know it's not cookies, but that's okay. I like popcorn, and I am learning that we just go with what we like. I like popcorn, so I'm putting it over here. And we like bells, so we're putting the bells over here. So I recently thought about something. I was watching someone else's video, and they were doing something, and I was just like, wait a minute. I could do something that's a little bit different, but similar. And yeah, so... That'll be coming soon-ish, maybe, possibly. Wow, what happened to my glue? Let's try that again with some actual glueage. Go on the paper. Like, have you ever done that? Like, just went to glue something and then, like, there's no glue there? I don't know what it is. I don't know if it just doesn't like this uh, shiny or what. Which would make sense. Brighter. Ooh, I'll put you right there. Let's do it this way. Ah. Is it okay if it's like complete chaos? Because I feel like it's okay if it's complete chaos. That's heavy. Look what I got. Okay. So, um, I first started with tearing up the, the deer because I wanted to keep the deer. And then I just went back in and I stole the other two pieces that I tore the deer out of the middle of. My husband literally looked at me like I was crazy. He's like, what are you doing? Nothing. I am doing nothing. You just wrap the present and don't mind me. So, ooh, can we put the deer over there? Let's 
So this is wrapping paper, and it's kind of funny, my whole wrapping paper story. So, um, yeah, I have a wrapping paper story. So, um, you know how we like to buy things when they're on clearance and when they go on sale, after season, you know, all that hoopla, right? Well, about, let's see, we've been here for, um, this is our second Christmas here. And so we've been here for almost two years. And um, we were in Washington for four and a half. So that's six and a half. I would say probably the year before we left. So seven and a half ish. So almost a decade ago, I bought some wrapping paper after Claire or after Christmas. It was on 90% clearance at Target. Ooh, you're pretty. And um so I decided to buy pretty much all of it. So we've had wrapping paper galore for a long time. And um I told Wayne, I was like, you know, it's kind of cool because we're finally starting to get down to the bottom of the wrapping paper. We actually have a normal amount of wrapping paper now. It's kind of funny. So this is one of the Christmas cards that I got because we did a Christmas card exchange. There were um, 22... I think 22 people on the list. Um, I also sent out a huge amount of just Christmas cards to other people for like happy mail. Um, and, but there were 22 part of the exchange. Oh, and pardon my finger. I actually have, uh, on this side, I stabbed my finger with a pin, like a pin. Because you guys know how, well, you may not, but I sell lace. And um, it's wrapped up. It, it was actually this lace right here. Um, and you can see the pin right there. It's like poking out a little bit. And I, I don't know. I went to grab it or something. And as soon as I grabbed it, it stabbed my finger. But it stabbed it like right on the crease. And so every time I, I touched it or anything, it just, it got really irritated. So I decided to cover it with a Band-Aid. It's not bleeding. I mean, I did it last night, but it's not bleeding or anything. Um, but yeah, I figured I'd go ahead and cover that up. Look at this guy. Isn't he just adorable? Can we put him down there? Let's put him down there. So anyway, that's what the band-aid is. I didn't do anything bad or, you know, I didn't like chop my finger off or anything like that. Uh, oh, I also did get some. Um, so I have like this one subscription box that I have is like for myself. Uh, actually, I think it's the only subscription box we have. But anyway, um, I have a subscription box for myself. And uh, it's Ipsy. And I don't know if any of you know what that is, but it's just, it's a makeup company or program or something like that where you can get like little sample things. Anyway, I got a new bag yesterday and I got this really cool eyeshadow. It's like all sparkly and brown. It's pretty. Anyway, I looked up and I saw it and I was like, oh yeah, I forgot I had that. Uh, let's see. Oh, can we put an ugly sweater? Oh, it's too big to go right there. All right, we're going to put you on this side. Would you stop that? All right. Um, let's see, what else do we got over here? Oh, we've got stickers. We have stick. Oh, wait, that's a whole card. Okay, let's put you in here. There's an envelope. We'll put you in there. Stop that. <laughs> Oh, we can do another. Oh, that'll cover up the thingy. 
let's do let's do that oh it doesn't cover it up all the way but this is to help me remember the bajillion Christmas cards that I sent out this year. Because I think after it was all said and done, it was like 250 or something, or 350 or something like that. I don't know. It was crazy. Oh, I like you a lot. Um, okay, let's turn the page. All right. What is our time? Ooh, 15 minutes. Okay. So let's go with some deers. I know that's not how that's said, but just hear me out. All right. Um, we'll do some, ooh, some Santas. Santa, Santa, Santa. This is actually from a bag. So I'm going to do some of those. Um, hold that. All right. So we're going to put you there and cut off the top a little bit. So who can figure out who, what my favorite Christmas symbol is? Just curious if anybody has figured that out yet. Not person, not who is my favorite person, but what is, what is the, the thing about Christmas? that I love so much. Yep, family, all that, yes. But there's just one word to describe the whole thing for me. What is that word? Anybody know? I've said it a few times. It's not like it's completely, totally random. But I have said it a few times, and I'm curious. And you know what? I think we'll make this even more better. Yeah, I know that's not a word. But we'll make this even better. And we will say, let's see, what, what, what can I do for you guys? Um, I can send you guys a little happy mail. That's what I can do. Um, so whoever gets the right answer, and I'll post it. This video is probably not going to post for a few minutes. But whoever um, gets the right answer, it's not going to be one winner. It will obviously be multiple winners. Well, hopefully it will be multiple winners. Um, but... Whoever gets the right answer, I will send you a little happy mail. And it won't necessarily be a Christmas card because I think I'm done with the Christmas cards. Um, but hopefully um, I can still send you guys out a cute little happy mail. And it won't be anything big. It'll just be in a little, you know, um, envelope like this. And, you know... Um, hmm. I want to use this, but I don't because it's got her address on it. So I think I'm just going to glue it straight down. All right. So we're just going to make a little pocket here. We're going to extend our glue book some because, well, why not, right? So. And I'll let you guys know um, I'll respond to you and uh, I'll figure out a way to respond to you. So uh, hmm. I'll have to figure this out, but I will figure out a way to respond to you. Oh, I know. I will respond in my Facebook group what the right answer is, but not today. So I'll give you guys a few days. That way, you know, a lot of people can 
um, you know, get their chance to win something. And it's nothing, like I said, it's nothing like great or grand or anything like that. It's just a little, a little something, something to say thanks for being a part of my life, for being a part of the, you know, adventure that I call the journey of crafting. So, question again. What is that one word? And it is just one word that is just so amazing about Christmas for me. It is what? And if nobody gets the right answer, then I'll figure something else out and we'll do something special. Mm, I don't want to do that. You're upside down. Can't do that. Okay. Um, mm. Nope, you cover you up. I really like, you know, I think I'm just going to make this page all about Santa. And no, Santa is not the right answer. But he's a clue. He is a clue. Who's gonna get it? Um... I guess I could put it that way, but I don't really want to put it upside down. I could just put it there. No. Oh, could make a lid. Ooh, that would be cool. To make like a little lid here. And then a pocket. We can do that. Let's do that. Why not? Oh, because there's nothing behind it. That's why not. Oh. So we'll go this route here. And this route here. Okay. And then I'll put you not upside down. I'll put you right there. Alright. Alright. There we go. Bloop, bloop. And we could also put some inside of it. Alright. Oh, I can put something on top of that. <laughs> what happens under the mistletoe stays under the mistletoe. That's cute. Oh, there was something that I wanted to put over here. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, dude? I had like a little phrase thingy. Phrase thingy, my bobber. Where'd you go? All right, who knows what I did with my phrases? Did I put them back away? Oh, wait. No, come back. Oh my gosh, I just flipped through this. I can't believe we've done that much already. That's crazy. Um, That's pretty. That's pretty too. And it says Christmas. All right. Where did you go?
You see what's great about this is I just give myself some more coverage to glue more stuff on. Alright, where did where did you go really? Really, really? Oh. No, that's only part of it. Did I put it away? I did. Cultivate kindness. I love that. Poof. Alright, put you there. We're almost done. Um, let's see. Ah, oh, I want to use you, but you're so little. Oh, hello. I like this, though. Let's just go to a different page. How about that? We'll finish this one later. All right. So we're going to cut off the bottom a tiny smidge. I think we're going to have to go a tiny smidge more than that. But yeah. By a tiny smidge, I mean at least an eighth of an inch. Oop. And it's still not enough. Wow, let's go from the top. This is actually the side of a bag. A gift, really. A side of a gift bag. Boy, fix. Much better. All right. So, and it's going to be a secret giveaway, by the way. So, nobody's going to know about it unless you watch the video. And you can hide it into your comments. Like, if you want to um, say that particular adjective, because it is, it's an adjective. But if you want to say that particular adjective and hide it within your comments, that is even better. Because then those people who didn't watch won't be trying to trying to sneak in. <laughs> But you can just say, I think Christmas is wonderful. Obviously, that's not the answer either. But you can try. Oh, you can't see. You can't see. You can't see. All right, I'm gonna use up all this Santa paper. I'm telling you, man. All right, I'll go this way, or we could just put it on a different page. Ooh, let's put it on a different page. That way, we've got Santa spread all the way out throughout the book, because that's fun. But this is really fun to just grab a handful of stuff. Glue it all down. You only got a few minutes, but you want to enjoy what you got. So, you just glue my stuff down. All right. So, this one we're going to put right over here. I'm going to take this, though, and I'm going to do a little once over here so it helps stick just a smidge better. 
and I'll wipe the sand dust on my pants. Don't do that. So that way it'll help the card stick a little better because it's just glue stick here that we're holding this card down with. Oh, and then we can put we can put stuff on this side too. But let's put an ugly sweater over here. Because why not? I like this. This is fun. Well, if I stick that upside down, that's not going to work. And that's not going to work. That's not going to work. That might. All right. Let's try. All right. We're going to do it that way. All right. It's going to be sideways, but that's okay. Because I'd rather it be sideways than upside down. All right. So now we've got a little pocket right here. I'm actually going to grab this. And we're going to poke a hole in it. Should have done this before I glued it down. It just makes it a little easier to get in and out of the pocket. That's all. <laughs> all right. Um. Oh, that's the wrong direction. This is my little phone holder. So I put my phone right there. Um, while I'm, one, recording, or two, if I'm, like, talking on the phone or whatever, and I have it on my phone and not my computer, then I'll put it over there. Ooh, we could put an ugly sweater over here, too, I think. Let's take you. You are on a little pop dot. We're going to flatten you out just a smidge. So I'm going to use Fabri-Tac because this is um, this is felt, so you can use Fabri-Tac, tacky glue, you know, what else? You can use all kinds of goody good stuff. I'm just going to turn them around a little bit. All right, and then. See what contrasts. I think, I think the green, the green would be good. Oh my gosh, what time is it? Oh, it's thirty-three. No, how did this happen? Okay, so, well, I guess that's it because well, it's already thirty-three minutes in, and I didn't realize that we had been playing for so long. I thought I was going like really fast, like choo -choo 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 -choo. and before I know it, um, 33 minutes has passed by. So, whoa. So anyway, don't forget about what we talked about earlier. And thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.